the health system that is built for all people, starting with primary health care, is a health system that is envisaged to be able to provide services that all people need all the time near where they live and near where they work. This health system is dependent on good investments in the key building blocks of such a health system. Now, when we talk about some of the services like mental health, they have lagged behind. And they have lagged behind because if you look at the key building blocks of health system, we have failed, governments have failed to actually invest in mental health as an integrated service in those building blocks. Do we have the commodities needed to make diagnosis, to support people who have mental health illness to lead a good life? If you look at finance, are we financing health services holistically so that we go beyond just the basic health service that we are used to of maternal and child health and infectious diseases and non-infectious to ensure that mental health is embedded as a core part of the overall health package that's available. We know that over 800,000 people commit suicide every year. Do we know the root cause of this and what key mental health illnesses are creating this? Do we have proper leadership, governance and management of the health system that is cognizant of this and that includes people's views and voices of those who have lived experiences, which is many of us, our families, our friends, and ourselves. So we need to think about mental health as a key part of the entire health system integrated so that we can achieve an equitable health system that is accessible to all people when they need it without financial difficulty.